Hi, I'm Dr. Lonnie Herman, and you have been receiving or you're about to receive some emails and videos from me describing your uh, chronic pain condition that you're still suffering from and your medical care or your holistic or alternative care has not brought you relief. And uh, what I want to do in this video is just give a brief introduction about myself so that you could understand where I'm coming from and uh, why I've gone in this direction to to be able to uh, give you the opportunity to relieve yourself from the condition that you're suffering from. Um, let me just start out by saying this. I went first to school to become a chiropractor. And uh, it was probably about 20 or so years ago that my older brother had hurt his back and had a herniated disc. And this was when I was in high school and I used to go with him to get treatment for his back pain with a chiropractor who we called doctor. And around that time in school, uh, my mother was telling me it's time to go forward in your life and you're gonna have to think of what you wanna do. It's either a doctor, a dentist, or a lawyer. So since we called this chiropractor a doctor, that's what I chose. And um, in chiropractic school, the philosophy was all about just get an adjustment and everything's gonna be fine and everybody needs chiropractic care. And, and while chiropractic care may benefit some people, to be honest with you, I noticed in my practice when I get out of school that people with chronic pain conditions did not get better with regular chiropractic care. People with chronic migraines, people with thyroid problems, people with lupus, people with some sciatica complaints, people with carpal tunnel, people with dizziness problems and insomnia problems and fibromyalgia problems and multiple sclerosis, chiropractic care did not seem to benefit them in the way that uh, I was told in school. So about, uh, let me fast forward now in my history, about four or five years ago, I was in a seminar where a doctor was up in front of the audience and he was talking about how the brain works and how we can actually assess the human brain and change the human brain. So uh, right after his presentation, I went up to him and I said, you know, Doc, I'm dealing with some patients in my practice who are not responding to my care. There are some people with a headache who get well. There are some people with a headache who don't get well. There are some people with back and leg pain who get well and some people who don't. And uh, which you'll see up in a coming video about one of the patients when I first started learning about this work I do, whose burning leg pain went away, not by treating her back, but by assessing and treating her brain. So right after this doctor presented himself, I went up and asked him some questions. He gave me some different neurological uh, tools, assessment type, uh, test um, techniques to go home on that Monday morning and assess my patients. And uh, he was even generous enough and nice enough with his time to offer me his phone number and, uh, and uh, call him when I had these exam findings. So long story short, I came home that Monday morning, called up some patients who were not responding well to my chiropractic physical therapy, the massage therapist, the spinal decompression and whatever else we were offering here. And uh, I, did, I got them to come back in the office because they still were not getting well with the dermatologist. They were not getting well with the rheumatologist, the neurologist, the orthopedist, the massage or the acupuncture, whatever it was that they were trying to do to relieve their pains. So I called them back up and they came in and I assessed them and I started seeing things with patients that I had never realized before. I never realized that you can look at the human brain and understand that there can be an imbalance. So I called up this doctor and uh, he offered me some unique treatments to help the person's brain uh, function better and it started to change and symptoms started to get relieved, which was amazing. And this is gonna be a little difficult for you to get right now, but let me just finish introducing myself and in upcoming videos, you'll understand more about what I'm about to share with you and help you relieve your condition. So when I went back to school to get this diplomate in functional neurology, which is different than medical neurology, you understand in the medical neurology world, it's all about run the test, run the MRI, the X-ray nerve conduction test and give you a pill or give you a shot. And some of you have probably already tried those anti-inflammatories and muscle relaxers, or have had injections into your back or your neck or your hand or had surgery, and you're still dealing with this pain. I mean, that's the only reason why you're viewing this video now. So um, I went back to school for this functional neurology because what we do different is that we can assess the human brain and we can change the brain function to relieve symptoms in the body. In an upcoming video, I will show you about the human brain and help you understand how the brain can become imbalanced and what we need to do to, to change that and help the body run better. 
But along in this neurology school, there was a doctor who was telling me about how the body is made up of different parts. It's not just the human brain. There's blood. There's hormones. There's a thyroid gland. There's a gastrointestinal system. There is brain chemistries called neurotransmitters. There's immune system and immune cells that most likely are going on, uh, on, uh, unstudied on a patient suffering with a chronic pain. So what I did was I decided to go back to school four and get certified in functional blood chemistry analysis, functional endocrinology, brain and neurotransmitters, mastering the thyroid gland, attention deficit disorders and developmental disorders of the human brain where kids become adults with these developmental disorders. I've gotten certified in functional immunology, gastrointestinal disorders and how to investigate them and relieve them because your gut does feed your brain and can cause certain pain disorders in the body. And also just recently, I, uh, the neurology school offered us a secondary degree in neurochemistry so I've already gone through, at this point that I'm filming this video, three quarters of the way through to get my degree in neurochemistry. So what hopefully you get out of this video and this introduction of myself is, is just to understand, when you come in to meet with me, you're gonna be sitting with a doctor who understands the function of the human brain and how it may be malfunctioning and what he needs to do to help you make your brain function better because your pain could be coming from here not to say it's all in your head, but literally the brain can become imbalanced and not be able to control the body properly. We'll get into that later. You're sitting with a doctor who understands about the endocrine system and how changes in the endocrine system or the hormone imbalances can affect the immune system and the brain and the cardiovascular system. You'll be sitting with a doctor who understands how to study the gastrointestinal system and the disorders that can be there and what we need to do to relieve it. You'll be sitting with a doctor who understands about immune cells about the chemistry of the cellular structures in your body and what we need to do to understand is there cellular breakdown, is there immune inflammation? And what the doctor understands about the brain chemicals, the brain chemistries that most often what I see in my practice when somebody's just on depressant medication for pain relief, uh, they're just not being handled properly and we can assess the brain chemistries and help you. Okay, so again, I just wanted to thank you for listening to this video and understand you're speaking to somebody who understands the body as a whole. And uh, in upcoming videos, you'll get to hear more about these different parts of the brain and different parts of the immune system and gut and, and so on. And, uh, and I can invite you into my office and I can help you. I understand your condition and I will help you differently than any other doctors have helped you. My number is 954-370-3100. And I look forward to meeting you. Thank you.